Hi, I'm Janet Patterson. Welcome to the Yukon Artists at Work Gallery and our latest show, Making the Pieces Fit by Erin Dixon. Erin is probably most well known, I'm going to swing around here to show you this. She is most well known for her large, very colorful landscape paintings like this one. But during COVID, she's taken up collage as a way of trying to make sense of the last couple of years and keep herself grounded. You are going to see a couple of main themes in this show. One is Alice in Wonderland, and I think she can really identify with Alice in a time where it feels like she's in an upside down world where nothing makes sense. Here's Alice shooing away some butterflies. Here she's looking at eyes, looking back at her. Here she's wandering through a mid 20th century living room set. The other main theme is imaginary places that are full of things that make Erin happy. You'll see lots of butterflies and other animals, flowers, cacti. She uses lots of bling. She loves sequins and sparkles. And so you will find that in a lot of her work. This is called Hipster's Paradise. And in almost all the pieces, you will find some kind of mode of transportation. In this case, it's the classic Volkswagen van. Erin did a lot of road trips with her family as a child, and that has really influenced her work. This is green space. Fountain of possibilities. This up here is probably my favorite. It's called Beatlemania, and she really evokes that feeling of late 1960s, early 70s, the hippie era. I love the colors. One of the great things about collage is that you can look at a piece again and again and again and always find something new. This is called Lilypad Living Room. This one, Time Flies, or What Happened at the Tea Party, has all kinds of references to time and clocks, and also some sayings that I think we can all relate to during this COVID era, to thine own self be true, patience, and hope. Here you can see Aaron's use of sequins Lots and lots of bling, lots and lots of time to put those on. And then there is a series called Dreams of Palm Springs. This show is on until the 27th of April. I hope you can come see it in person.